Well, hi. Hi. Hey. Hey. Howdy. Hey. I feel like we do. We're trying to do like regular Costco hauls on my channel. We should have like a little theme song for the. You always. I always have want to have a, theme a theme song. song. You always. You always do this. I. I, I like a. Th I like a good no, theme song. Good theme song's good. good. Think of like the Golden Girls. Perfect this is true. theme song. This is true. Friends. Just, rain or snow, it's time to go to Costco. Something like well, that. There you, well, that was, was right. Just, gosh, you're right there. <laughs> just play it every time we do a Costco haul. Anyway, uh, there is a new Costco in town. Mm -hmm. And we came here a couple weeks ago, but it was packed because it was like brand Very new. Very new, yeah. Um, and so like it was, and anyway, so I'm excited to like hopefully have a little bit more time to yeah. go and see. It's like the it's like different, but not, you know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, you know, Costco, they all look the same, but every things it's, were just slightly moved around. I'm like, wait, where's the bakery section? Like, where are, am yeah. I? <laughs> It's laid out just ever so slightly. Ever so slightly different. Yeah, but we, like, at our Costco, I'm like, I know where everything is. It's like, oh, it's fun. It's like a fun challenge because we're 30, and that's what passes for fun now. And it okay. is fun. I don't care. <laughs> Let's Good go. clean fun. It's time to go to Costco. They need cup holders. Oh, how have they not figured that one out? Oh, well, we got... For our friends, boiler up. Okay, so when you first walk in, they have some clothes here, and that is confusing to me. Yeah, the fact that there's, there, yeah, right? I'm like, so, no, don't split it up. This is too confusing. They have an 86 inch TV, 86 inch TV for $950. That's because like, here's the same size, 2200. Like that kind of makes sense. Like, yeah. That is, that's an insane deal. That's crazy. Yeah. Like, you basically get a TV <laughs> for free now. <laughs> Still so much money. Look at that. A big thing of decaf. I'm loving this. I mean, I like a good caffeine. Now, what I really need is a big thing of half calf. That would really, that would really do it for me. I just really want to stand by a riverbed with my foot up on a rock and look out and Wistfully. take some deep breaths. <sighs> Last time we were here, Genevieve was asking for one of these. Like, no, kid, <laughs> no. It's getting to be that season. We got to get our, we got to get serious about our garden, honestly. <laughs> hey, Tyler, we do need some potting soil, don't we? Yes, I do need to grab some. Also, okay. like, we're not allowed to have, like, mini barns and stuff like that, but I'm like, Our neighborhood. can we have something like that? Like, where do, they, where do we draw the line here? Where it's, like, a storage closet versus a... I feel like that's pretty a much a mini barn, yeah. Look at that cool, like, greenhouse-looking one, I though, there. I had that last year, It's too. really pretty. This is really cool. It's a planter. It's, like, 150 I just love that. There it is. That's what it looks like. So it's, like, right at hip height. It's pretty cool. Every time I see a paper shredder here, all I think of is Mitch from Modern Family. <laughs> Every time. Why, I don't, what is this and why is it? It's a wireless charging desk lamp with a- Sure, thing. that's all fine, but, but why is it I didn't so... exactly, I was like, <laughs> what is it so What if so I wanted niggly? to like stay in a place? No, it's not, <laughs> I ain't doing that. It's like Quail Man from uh, Doug. <laughs> it's just, that's something, that is something. Okay, two things. I don't remember if I got it here or if I got it somewhere else, but I got like a kit for my Blackstone last year, uh, and it was awesome because I used all of it so much. The one thing this has though is it's got a bigger spatula there. It's like that big. Yeah. That'd be nice to have. Yeah. Uh, also, I'm excited to get the Blackstone popping for the season. I got one of these for Christmas from Jessica, the Chef IQ. It is awesome. It is the coolest thing in the world. But this one comes with two. It's a meat thermometer. It's a meat thermometer. And you put it in the oven. And you, like There's different recipes you can do. Or you can just stick it in your meat there with a certain temperature you're trying to get the to. The oven and on the grill. It, uh, there's a little speaker in the box itself. So it'll tell you when it's ready. Or you can use it on your phone. Like It's so cool. But this is a two a, a set of two of them. 99 bucks a few. That's a good deal for a set of two. Uh, it is. I'm trying to think of what I paid for yours. I is didn't it, buy it at Costco. I didn't even know they. But it is. It's pretty cool amazing like it is one of the coolest things like i don't know how i live without it because i use it a couple times a week now mm -hmm. like, it is so cool but the fact that this is two ooh. we ended up buying this last month when we were here we didn't film it um because i wanted the background of my videos but i also just love it and i'm like i also kind of want it like in our family room. <laughs> it's really yeah it's so pretty i feel like it looks well you can't i was gonna say it looks really pretty when it's nice and fluffed out but um it was pricey though, but I was looking for ones that looked like this online, that like looked good, and they were even more. They were like two hundred dollars. Okay, so it was expensive, but I am very excited. I need to get it out of the box. So. Yeah, it's yeah. It doesn't look like it's too complicated to put together. Time. I think there's no, only a few I don't spots. Even think you... Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, we'll figure it out. But it, it's really pretty. So, 
anyone use a rice cooker? <laughs> I just saw one and I thought, oh, it's an air fryer. And I look at my, oh no, it's a rice cooker. I'm like, gosh, I haven't thought about rice cookers. Does anyone have one that is just a rice cooker and still use that? I'm very genuinely curious because I feel like most people would just have an all-in-one thing that could do that. But I also just cook rice I on, the stove, it, like, yeah, on the stove in a pot. If it's like for dinner. Talk about dinner, a multi-use yeah. cooker. Right. These are cool, kind of Stanley-esque. But they're two packs for 24 bucks. That is way cheaper than a Stanley. Those are kind of cute for the kids. The reduced, what is it, $14.99. They're like smaller, spill-proof straw. I love these colors too. Okay, so this is a little pricey, but these Wusthof knives, when I almost went to culinary school, this was the knife that they that was on like the kit list that I needed to buy. But this is a good a good set, I feel like, because you have like the the chef's knife, which is more of like a santoku kind of style here. But you have a bread knife and you have a pairing knife. Like if I had three knives, those would be the three I had. Those are different enough. You know, so many people have like twelve knives. I'm like, those are the three I use. I feel like well, we, ninety five percent of the time. Us, we have twelve knives. That's what I'm saying. But oh, you're right. These my are the whole ones point is, if you if you're buying a new set or whatever, uh, this is like those are the three I use for 95% of what I do. Every once in a while, I'll grab another one, but it's pretty rare. Those are the three you need. <laughs> one of Tyler's greatest gifts for me he ever got was this set. It's these vacuum seal, which you might be like, okay, no, no, it's this little wand. And yep. you just put it on top of the lid and push the button. It takes like five seconds. And Sucks these all are the just these out. nice glass, yeah, jars. We do need a replacement lid though for, oh, well, that doesn't usually come off. But anyway, we need a Is replacement it? lid for one of them, but they also have the bags. So we put our Parmesan like block of cheese in it. Yep, and it sucks, sucks it all the air out. Like, Keeps it so much fresher for so much need, longer. You don't need like a big, oh my gosh, I've never thought about it for avocado. And you know what too? The we bag. also- I always put my avocado in those and it does yeah. last. A much days. longer mm -hmm. um, but the other thing is too I never even like it has so many more functions like it has QR codes I'm pretty sure you can like keep stock of what you have and like, when well, you and do the it date you put, put it, it in, in the there. fridge right so it does a lot more than I think we even use it for yeah. um, it's but, amazing yeah. you guys this is an insane deal yeah that's a that's a great deal we that should is a great deal. ours is like I said I think maybe a generation before this but yeah fresh up to five times longer I feel like I do feel like we waste less food <gasps> they have one for a wine sealer what Oh Whoa. man, this is awesome. Okay. <laughs> okay, we have one of these, not this brand, but our five and almost two year old play with this like crazy. Like crazy. And you can build all kinds of different things. So that. You can make it into like a couch, you can make it into a car. What is it? 150. You can make a hat, a brooch, a pterodactyl. They have versions on Amazon too, we can link below that might be cheaper, but still, that's a pretty good deal. I will forever be amazed at their prices for like full Disney sets. How cute is that? They got some Minnie Mouse. They got some really cute Mickey Mouse sets too. Look at this. <laughs> so cute. We're in the clothing section and I can't, I don't think they have the shorts that I'm looking for. I want to buy a new box of my shorts. A crate of your shirts. A crate of my shirts. Okay. Love me some Levi's. That's a pretty good price. Levi's can get weirdly expensive, I feel like. Um, but these are these high rise they're not skinny jeans they're slim straight and they're cropped which i'm realizing i like because then you can kind of just wear any shoes with them i don't know i just prefer cropped jeans i'm realizing versus ones that are too long but these are just good everyday jeans so i'm gonna get a pair hopefully they fit <laughs> if not i can always return them or exchange them found them here they are i wear these seven days a week <laughs> okay i eyed these last time these champion sweatshirts i'm looking for a medium in like this really i really want this green or in the pink but they don't have that size they do have it in the white but i already have a white like hoodie i got from here re recently um but yeah it's just classic and really comfy mama mia so Here saw, I go again. We saw Mama Mia in concert in one of the outfits. Not in concert, on stage. Like at the <laughs> real show. Concert, the real show. The Broadway tour. The Broadway anyway, tour. Um, the main girl was wearing this outfit that I don't know what it was. It was so classic. It was just like these kinds of capris and then a white shirt. And it was just so simple and so cute. And I told Tyler we're going on a long trip this summer with the girls. And I was like, I want an outfit like that. I want to recreate. And then lo and behold. Boom. That's exactly what she was wearing, through. I swear. I know. It's stretchy. They're just like pull on pants, which yes please so nice very excited i know i was kind of joking about it but i really do love these shorts because like they they're like 
I just all spill coffee on them or something. And they, I love that you're but, wearing them today. But they've got zips, the back pocket zips. Yeah. I have some in our, like, whenever we go to Disney, these are the ones I wear. Like, I wear them. Like, it, I have, like, our owner's tote there, and I have some there. But, like, they're stretchy stuff. I'm bringing down to pick up kids. Like, they're the, just, the, like, the most comfortable shorts, and they've got them in every color. I know I won't shop about it, but... Yeah, you are really shorts. into it. I love this for you. Um, I'm thrilled. Big fan, big fan of these shorts. They're, they're actually, I will say, I like them, because I... We don't really need to iron them. Yeah. They don't... They pretty much stay wrinkle-free, so that's, and that's again, nice, too. Like, they do the waterproof thing where it, like, you know... Wicks uh, off. Wicks off and stuff. Yeah. And I have wanted a pair of hiking poles my entire life. I don't need them. I would never use them, but I really, really want some. And these are extendable, telescoping. I would never use them. I just really, really want some though. So they have these like water play things and it's mm -hmm. obviously getting to be summer. None of these are priced all that badly. That's 50 bucks. 50? This little 20. splash yeah, pad is 20. Pad. And then this like pool where you can like sit in the pool with the kids is 40. Listen, I selfishly want to play in that. I just, I feel like we would get a lot of use out of it. Even if it's one summer, like we would use the heck out of it. Yeah. But which do we get? I, I know. Cause with two, there, like, like that's six plus, but I'm like, well, if we're in there, I wouldn't sorry. let Felicity alone in that. No, no, so, no. So my point is like, we could, we really could do any of these. That well, was the original one that pulled us in. Size wise, this is the splash pad. That, like, That's the splash pad. pad. It's huge. Like, the dragon thing. Wow. I don't know. I feel like we, would, we would play with it a lot if we had. I know. All right. I think we've decided against this because we think they would end up having more fun with the splash pad. And we think we're going to get the splash pad and the pool so we can enjoy it. Well, so like this, I could see them like sitting in like playing with toys and stuff in it yeah this i, I might even see put this floating on there yeah, yeah yeah and then this one i could see them like actually sitting and again playing with toys and stuff like running that running around versus yeah. this they just they would run through it and they would have fun running through it but i think they would spend more time on this well and 20 plus 40 spend 60 bucks and get two different things versus 50 on one i think i think that makes dollar sense to me <laughs> i'm excited we're excited yeah, think, for summer yeah. oh my gosh Cannot wait. I want it to be oh. 95 degrees outside. That's so much to ask. Also no. for 85. And also, in the future, we could always do something like that, too. You know, I'm sure they do something like this yeah, every year. Yeah, I mean, it's not a like uh, life sentence, that, but yeah. I'm excited. All right, so we've entered the food area. I'm getting these for um, the girls and myself. Because I know they like graham crackers, but these are kind of, I think, maybe slightly healthier. But they also are just more bite-sized, which is nice. Got some bananas that we needed. These are $10 and they are so ridiculously good. So I'm very excited to get this. The smaller bags of this at the regular store are so expensive for like six of them. So very excited to have a giant bag. And I don't think I'm gonna buy them today, but I had these at my sister's and they were so, so good. $8.99, it's got almonds, pumpkin seeds, cashews. Mm. Also gonna grab some of these um, because there's two ingredients. What are the two ingredients? Yeah, apples and mangoes or apples and strawberries. I think the girls would love them. Okay, trying the little bobos. They had the sample, like the muffins. What do you call them muffins? They're denser. This is the apple pie. It's pretty good. <laughs> Tyler and I have learned to start taking allergy medicine weeks before our allergy season starts and it has helped so much the past few years. Allegra is what we've been doing the past few years, so gonna get some of those for us. Also, this is absolutely the best eye allergy drops, um, although we do not need three. I already bought one of those, but this is the best. If you've never tried them, recommend. These are our favorite protein shakes, and we've not seen them the past few times. They're now selling them in a smaller pack, though. I'm like, dang it. But it's still cheaper than buying them at the store. Um, we're just a little more selective on how often we drink them because they are more expensive, but they taste so much better. So I'm so thrilled they have those. All right, Z-Bars. I'm tired of buying the six packs at the store for really expensive, so glad to get that. Tyler, prunes? Mm -hmm. Oh, plums. No, Wait, dried plums are prunes. Plums, yeah. Pretty oh, I was gonna say, why was I so confused? And then this looked pretty good. Breakfast, breakfast links, sausages. chicken, chicken breakfast sausages. That's just making me hungry for eggs, honestly. And then we didn't see these last time, so I was glad to find them again. These are so great for quick lunches or to throw in salad, a wrap, whatever. I don't know why, but Total Eclipse of the Heart is stuck in my head and I've been singing it over and over again. <laughs> I cannot get it out. <laughs> I have a guess as to why. 
And I guess the eclipse is coming up, but I don't... Was somebody talking about it? Yeah, everyone I think so. has I think, been. I think actually what happened is somebody said, turn around, and it's been stuck like, turn yeah. around. <laughs> Every now and then. <laughs> so yeah, this is, we were just talking about what are we going to do It today. says lay flat, be careful. <laughs> oh, we have dinner for tonight, and we'll let you probably have a couple more meals set up for the week. And I was like, okay. That's Looking pretty good. Room. Yeah. Lasagna, I mean, bread. that's making it look real good. Mm. Italy's most loved. Wow. Wow, that's, that's old, old statement. Old statement. <laughs> wonder if anyone asked anyone from Italy. <laughs> Look at that. These are so good. But you know what? They don't have Doc Pop, which is one of the best ones. I will say strawberry lemon is a close second, though. So, but it is $20 for 15 Always. Produce chat with Jessica. We got some tomatoes. These are so good if you've never had this kind. Um, got some blueberries, some salad. We like the spring mix avocados and uh, what else we got brussels sprouts big thing of broccoli thing of apples raspberries we're sitting pretty with produce <laughs> well i take back what i said they have another version that does have the doc pop and i have to say with the lighting i thought that said crap <laughs> that's great <laughs> i just saw somebody leaving and they had three boxes of this in his carton that's all he had it says fire brewed craft soda wow it's root beer it says made with honey well, this is interesting. We have three boxes of it. Huh. I, I want to try it. But I don't want to buy a giant. I need to buy 48. Although, as if we're not going to like 24. it. We love Who doesn't love root beer? That's true. I'm like, do we just bite the bullet and do it? I don't know. <laughs> Wait, I thought it was the bear now. Okay, we've had a version of these. We're not sure if they were the same ones. Of these lemon bites that are <laughs> so unbelievably good. We're not going to buy them this time, but oh my gosh, $6.99. If you like lemon desserts, you will never look back. These are so good. Girl Scout, Chip Witch, ice cream sandwiches. Oh, these are insanely good. That's next level. Mm -hmm. All right, getting our coffee as usual. This is our go-to, but I think you can only get it more locally. I think we're going to also try this one. We like light and medium roasts. This one's medium. Copper Moon looks good. Okay, we've never done this before, but... On the Blackstone, it's really easy to just throw some veggies out there. And then you, with the, um, feels like, like a hibachi thing. <laughs> Stir fryer, yeah. yeah. Um, and so just doing this with like rice and stuff like that. Throw yeah. an egg out there. Kind of make your own homemade fried rice almost. We haven't tried this before though, but I feel it's like. It's one giant bag? I think so. Okay. So like maybe use like half at a time. Yeah, exactly. Oh, nice. Okay, that's kind of perfect then. You could use a third of it at a time. Right, honestly, yeah. 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 So a while ago we got this, not this brand, but a balsamic glaze and it's so good on so many things. Brussels sprouts. So it's not just balsamic vinegar. It's like the glazed version of it, but we can't it's like find a reduced, it. reduced, yeah. So we just saw this. We don't need it right now, but I'm like, this is definitely what we're getting the next time we run out. Well, the balsamic, um, the Brussels sprouts that I have on my, on my website, the recipe, um, I actually just updated with a like weeknight version of it because the way that I make them, it's a little involved. And so I found a, a faster, easier way, specifically using uh, a balsamic reduction, balsamic glaze like that. It is so good and so much easier. I will link that recipe below if you're interested. And it's one of those things where so many times people are like, I don't like Brussels sprouts. And then I make them these Brussels sprouts. And they're like, oh, okay. I think I like Brussels sprouts now. <laughs> There's a big old vat of nacho cheese over there and we both looked at it and we're like you know that's good i'm sure it's all like melted saran wrap and yellow number five but i'm sure it's delicious <laughs> all right we ended up also getting a front door rock <laughs> it was a big trip but i think we're good to go all right mission accomplished we did yes, it we did. we did um it was one of our bigger trips yeah which is interesting because i felt going into today i was like we don't need too much and not everything we got we needed, of course, because that's the Costco way. Fool's errand to think you can go in there without leaving without a cart full of stuff. That's so true. I think a lot of the things we got, I just planned to get at a regular grocery store, like berries yeah. and stuff. And then when we were there, I'm like, I mean, their produce always well. looks good. So, yeah. Tis All right. It is, but... Well, I hope you enjoyed that. And we'll see you. Hey, I'm sure we'll do this subscribe. again. Subscribe. Yeah. I was like, if you enjoy, subscribe to Tyler's channel. I'll do these every so often. Shameless plug. I also have a channel. What's it called? It's called It's Jessica Braun. <laughs> Very clever. <laughs> anyway, so if you like vlogs and stuff like that, sometimes you're over there, sometimes I'm over here. Yeah, we go visit on each other's channels. <laughs> go visit. Can Tyler come out? Uh, we are very tired. We were we're just talking so about, tired. like, oh my gosh, we're losing our minds. Anyway, yeah, yeah. all right, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Ya. See you later. Bye.